Hello everybody, this is Mark at KnifeGloves.com. Just wanted to put up a video to make an announcement regarding some changes that are coming to the Hero and Avenger gloves. Uh, as most of you know, I offer three gloves. I offer the Hero, the Avenger, and the Template glove. Now the Hero and the Avenger gloves are just my own basic representation of the original glove from Nightmare 1 and Nightmare 2 and uh, they are the most affordable on my website um, and the Hero Glove is currently priced at $175 plus shipping and the Avenger Glove is $200 plus shipping. Now as most of you know I have recently, well not recently but a little while ago I shut down my website and stopped taking orders uh, for pre-orders to get people on my list. Um, most people said they didn't care about how long it would take, they just wanted to know that they were on my list. Um, and so I allowed people to submit orders willy-nilly, just whenever they wanted to, uh, just so they could get their name on my list. And after doing that for a little while, my list got too long. Um, I should have seen it coming, it's happened before, um, but I decided to give in because so many people asked, you know, just, just let me submit, I just want to be on your list. And so I gave in and it turned into too much of a workload. Because seriously, um, if you've built gloves before, taken orders before, having a long list of people waiting on you can be very mentally draining um, and stressful. And so, and sometimes you just can't control what goes on in your life and it may just make it, make the wait times unbearably long. So. I do want to say that I'm very thankful for your patience. Um, I've been trying to get through my list. I'm working on a bunch of orders right now at the same time, working on about 10 gloves at once, and I will be getting a ton of those out before Halloween. So uh, just know that that's coming down the, down the pike. So having said that, um, when I begin taking orders again, um, in order to slow the number of orders that come in, I've decided to increase the price of the Hero and the Avenger gloves. Um, I've decided that both, or I've determined that both gloves roughly take around the same amount of time and the same amount of work. And so I've decided to price them at the same point. Uh, previously, the Hero glove was $25 cheaper than the Avenger glove. Um, but now both gloves will be priced at $250 plus shipping when I begin taking orders again. Now, I told several people on Facebook and through direct communication or whatnot uh, that after developing the template glove, uh, with after spending time at Mike Becker's house with the original screen use glove, I, that I would not be changing in any way my, my Avenger or my Hero gloves. However, after I decided to increase the price in order to slow the number of orders, I didn't feel justified in doing that and offering the same glove as before. Some people have said, it's okay, they're worth that much anyway, but I just did not, I did not want to offer the same glove at a higher price. And so what I basically did was take the measurements, the, the dimensions of the glove from the, from the movie, and, and applied that, those measurements to my templates for the Hero and Avenger gloves. They're the same templates, um, I've just resized them. Now after resizing them, uh, some of the curves and angles got a little skewed, it looked a little funky when I cut out some test parts, um, and so I did make some fine tooth uh, adjustments just to make them look better, and so to the point where I was satisfied with them. And after doing that, I came up with this. So this is a prototype build using the newly revised Hero and Avenger Glove templates. Um, it is the same size as the glove from the movie, since I did use the same measurements. But the templates are not, um, I guess, screen accurate, can you say. Uh, they're just a rough representation of, of the glove from the movie. And so, if you're familiar with the with the glove from the movie, you'll you'll see many many identifying characteristics. But I do not guarantee that it is screen accurate, as I do with my template glove. Um, so, with that being said, I also fiddled around with the riveting system that I use on my gloves. Um, 
especially these rivets here around where the fingertip attaches. Um, I tried a new riveting technique and I am very very happy with with the way it turned out. The, the fingers move much smoother, um, they're much tighter, not to say that they're harder to move but it just there's less wiggle I guess between the parts and so it feels much more solid uh, but, at the same, but at the same time it feels much smoother. So if you've, if you've worn gloves built by me before you're familiar with how they feel and of course I know how they feel and so I know the differences with the way that the fingers move and I'm very very satisfied with with this change and so if you currently have a, a pre-order submitted and want to upgrade to these new these new templates um, I will be contacting you directly through your probably your PayPal email address um, and letting you giving you a link to this video so hello uh, and letting you know that this is an option it's just if you choose to upgrade just the balance that is due when your glove is built will be will reflect that price increase and so but if you don't care too much about these new templates and think that you're fine with the with the current templates as they as they're currently offered um, then I'll just proceed as normal and your your balance owed will remain the same as it as it currently is um, and so just wanted to throw that out there let you know of these changes that are coming now, I won't be able to offer these templates um, on a large scale uh, for maybe one to two months so if you're close to the beginning of my list at the top of my list and you choose to upgrade it may bump bump you back down um, while I wait for the ability to to produce these in a larger scale um, and so having said that um, I wanted to offer you a better product if at a higher price um, just so I could maintain my list a little bit better now when I do begin taking orders again I will no longer be offering the old templates so the cheaper versions of the gloves will no longer be available and these will be the new standard I guess for my hero and Avenger gloves so if you have any questions feel free to contact me on Facebook you can find me under Mark Petrie I'm in Salt Lake City Utah um, or you can just hit me on my website knifegloves.com send me send me an email through there and I'll get back to you as soon as I possibly can and it's generally pretty quick how I get back to people um, so having said that again uh, thank you for taking some time to listen to this announcement um, send me your questions if you, have, if you have any complaints or questions or inquiries or anything else um, just let me know I'll be glad to help out where I can so uh, thanks for watching, and I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.